as a director of the Science to Business Marketing Research Center in uh, Münster University of Applied Sciences. I would like to ask you, why do you think marketing is so important within industry-university relations? Well, the conference is called Science to Business Marketing Conference because uh, it is leaving traditional technology transfer and knowledge transfer concepts far behind. Uh, we are convinced um, that markets are playing the main role in the future technology transfer. If universities are still uh, inventing or uh, developing something on just basic and pure research, and there's no link to markets, potential markets, potential benefits, uh, then the business, so-called business of universities in cooperation with uh, companies is turns out to be very, very hard. So the poor people in the technology transfer offices, they have to deal with this, finding an application, a market, uh, a user uh, for a technology which has been developed without any market um, idea. Um, and we turn it upside down. So we start with the needs, expectations, um, wants of, uh, university, of uh, industry and we involve this in a very early stage in the, in the research. That doesn't mean that we skip basic research totally but we add some potential benefit of industry in the development process. And if you look at markets in early stages then the technology will have uh, a certain stage when it is marketable and then the business between universities and industry will be very easy to do. Um, also within the conference we are talking about cross-sectoral value creation. And my question is how do you think universities and business can co-create value together? Well, uh, what I just said is uh, more a market relation like uh, a university is offering something to industry and they apply it and spend money for it, buy it. This is like a client. The next step, once there have been several projects together with universities and a company, it turns into a partnership relationship. And uh, building on mutual trust, building on experience uh, from uh, former uh, projects. And once they have a relationship, a partnership uh, created, then they can do things together which is creating an additional value for both organizations and then we call it partnership rather than uh, clients. Okay, thank you. My last question was uh, about the future, the future of university industry relationships. How do you think it's going to be in let's say 10 years? Well, uh, it will hopefully and uh, our knowledge society and our uh, industry society is really relying on this uh, far more developed than today. Today we still have the problems you wouldn't believe it but we still have problems in cooperation with uh, academic sector and uh, the industrial sector <coughs> but due to the people visiting those kind of conferences um, that process will improve uh, a lot and uh, we need it, uh, especially if you think uh, that we are in competition uh, to other countries around the world. Europe is in competition and uh, our com competitive situation is purely based on knowledge and innovation. And if we um, don't follow this innovative track uh, consequently, and that can be done by university business cooperation very, very well, then we will lose uh, um, importance in, in the world. So this is the reason why it will happen. And what we are doing here in this conference is open up ways and introduce instruments and models and approaches on how that can be really well done.